Coach, uh, as we look ahead uh, to this season, uh, I suppose you've been planning for this season since last year season ended. What are your numbers going to look like, do you think, and where's your leadership at? Um, we're going to have about 21 girls this year, which is quite a few less than we normally have, but we graduated eight seniors last year, so um, we do have four returning lettermen coming back, so we're hoping to have some leadership out of those seniors and the other two underclassmen that have quite a bit of experience on varsity. How many, how many of your kids, uh, I know a lot of the coaches around, uh, their kids are doing uh, summer uh, volleyball and playing at different places like at Hayes and stuff. Do your kids do that? Um, we've gone to several things as a team, and I had lots of them play in club teams over the winter time too. So that makes it pretty busy if they're doing other sports, right? Yes, definitely. Um, but it's a good experience anytime they can get on the court. Um, I'm all for that. Do you have a um, a feel for the Northwest Kansas League um, race for the uh, the teams? It seems like the coaches I've talked to in preparation for the season they seem to think this league is pretty deep. Your thoughts? I agree with that. Um, I think it'll be a pretty competitive league. Um, I think there's some teams that we play quite a bit in the league, so we kind of get to know each other pretty well. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because it's hard to beat the same team several times, but um, I'm looking forward to a lot of good competition between all of us. Well, listen, uh, good luck to you for the Red Devil volleyball team for the upcoming season. We'll follow you. One thing I did want to ask you, uh, the last couple of years, both the WKLL and the NWKL, L have had uh, gone together for one big, huge league tournament. Now they're separated again this year. Uh, you like the separation, or would you like? Did you like it together? Both. Um, I like having um, just our own Northwest Kansas League. You know, because there's like we don't play Greeley County during the regular season at all, unless they come to our tournament and we play there. But so I'm glad to be able to have just a, a defined league tournament winner but i also really enjoy playing lots of different teams and having that massive competition between everybody yeah somebody said earlier uh, when i talked to them they thought uh, that the two leagues going together almost made for a state tournament environment right i would agree it, it was in colby event center is a perfect place for it you can watch a lot of volleyball all at one time and got a big uh, space for lots of fans and lots of cheering loud competitive volleyball so all right, listen, uh, good luck to you. Uh, as this season rolls along, we'll be covering the Red Devil Volleyball team. Thanks for your time. All right, thank you very much. Coach Fortin visiting with us, the head coach of the uh, Red Devils in Oberlin, brought to you by Farm Credit of Western Kansas, also Colby Community College, many businesses throughout the Oberlin community. Thanks for watching.